All right, I see live, and I see something working on my Twitch today. Yay, my Twitch browser's working today. That's awesome. Well, it was. All right, let's get back to work. <laughs> it froze again. I don't know what's going on with that. All right, so what do I got my bags? Just that, okay, good. We'll be ready to move stuff around. Let's wait to see if I get anybody pop in real quick, and we will start moving stuff. I wonder if I should put anything on these to kind of signal that that's the basement. Hmm. Don't know. Well, let's start grabbing boxes. How many? This one? Let's go to this one. Grab them all. Let's get to work. So someone had mentioned on the Discord if I had any intention. Uh, I'm trying, man. I'm trying to remember where I put those. Okay, so it's that little bit right there. So apparently, this is something I hadn't thought about before. If you stick it out just a little bit versus how most of us do it, honestly relatively flush in there it's easier for two people to access the box at the same time I hadn't even thought about that so I might I might change up the basement a little bit so they do stick out a little more just to help on that front uh, we will see as we get in there and see how because that's a that's a lot of work to move all those it's a heck of a lot of work. Do, do, do. Settings. Let's bring the music up a little bit. Let's try 15. All right. Very nice. We need to get some mannequins. Okay, so we have 66 in there. 46. I don't think I, I haven't used 20. I've used 14. Right? So I've used. Assuming that was at a 20. I don't remember 100% if it was. So. 12. I think that's how many I need. Alright, back to work. This is going to look so good. With all the uh, all the dudes on this, full of all their gear, especially with the new gear, it's gonna look so cool. And I saw read a comment on the Discord. They replied to me. Uh, apparently, Cub, which is cool, username Bro. He's one of the community managers, along with Toast and 
actually, Cub and Toast might be the only two that are community managers. Um, I don't know when it was said, and take this with a, uh, a pinch of salt, because I haven't verified myself. Uh, apparently, we are getting six, or about six, new building blocks, which does include a roof tile. Uh, the roof tile is kind of a slate-looking jobby, and the slate one's actually already in the game. In fact, uh, two of them that are pictured in one of the teaser videos and pictures that they did on Twitter to, to today, yesterday, today, yesterday, something like that, overnight, something like that, uh, they're actually already in the game because people on the the uh, Builder's Companion use it. Shade actually uses it for his public resource world called Fort Resources. So those are, at least those two are confirmed, and then maybe as many as four more. Kind of a last minute shove in on accident. I think it would be alright. So yeah, I'm excited about that, man. The, uh, the slate look is going to be very nice for people who want to make more... I don't know, more, more gothic look, because right now we have to use the stone, which isn't terrible. It's a fine look, but I think the slate is just much slicker, and it's got a kind of pointy ridge roof, which looks really cool, like spikes, or something like spikes, I don't know. Do-do-do-do... gonna be fun. Alright. Must has more mannequins. Right. And back to boxes. Hmm. I don't want to do this. Do I want to do... Are we going to do it the same way where it's... Just like that? I need to put a mannequin on and see what that looks like. I think we have very little choice because it's not going to sit on that ledge there. Yeah, it sinks through the ledge. So I think, yeah, because that just caps the back of the feet. So that's, that's going to be our uh, spot.
good spot. It's weird, even when I line myself up, <laughs> I get confused as where I'm putting it when I grab the new box. I don't know why. Like a brain teaser or something. Okay. Grab some of these guys. Make sure I'm not kneecapping them. That's a really good question. I need to figure... Well, no, it's the same thing. It has to be the same way, otherwise the mannequin gets its feet messed up. So we just continue to do the same way in all of these. Stop at the second band of metal around the box. Must has more boxes. Yeah. I might have overdone it with uh, duping the boxes, but that's okay. I don't mind having a little extra. <laughs> At least that way I know it'll be finished. That's backwards. There we go. Like I don't see the second piece there. I'm not doing a very good job of getting those straight. I did a good job over there. What's up with this side? What is going on? I just don't know how life works, apparently. It's a little better. Yeah, it's, it, there's one down there at the end sticking out a little bit much, but I'll probably be all right. And after I get all this set, then the fun task of actually going through and making sure that we have everything. 
because I guarantee you there's little bits here and there that we do not have. The public resource world v3.5 because this was uh, when this was created it was strictly in game stuff nothing else. I actually was one of the first ones to add more than just the level 23-25 gear uh, because I was adding lower level sets. Alright, so we got all that. Put these jobbies in. But there's a lot of like non-sets out there. Uh, by that I mean it's got three pieces or sometimes just one, just one named piece. But now that we have cosmetics and uh, all of these mannequin stands, I want to make sure people have the option to build out their, uh, their base however they want to. I need to learn to math by one. I was off by one. All right. Okay. So now that we have all that, and you can just run and go through it. I like that idea too. Seems to me like there should be some kind of an embellishment on this end. I'll have to figure something out about that. Maybe a little uh, a banner on the end or something that sticks down some. We'll figure something out. Alright, let's go to the very lowest first. Level 8. Is level 8 even the lowest? I think he only makes like this stuff. They don't show their your set stuff too. I mean, there is the fur, but it's kind of unilateral. And then if I do this. We have this, the rags. Oh, yeah. All right, let's try this again. Take a look at what he's got in the low end stuff. it's universal. Now this at level 8 is when he starts getting into more physical resist and health regen and health. Okay, so the super duper low stuff is everybody. Let's check on him just to see what his lowest is. What's up big boy? Armor. Apprentice stuff is level 8. I'm pretty sure this is what I've got. That's a huge bonus for a level 8 item. The rest is garbage, but 
That is incredible. <laughs> Apprentice, mage, healer, herb, magician, sage, archmage, warlock. Let's see if I remember all that when I go in here and make sure we have it all. Apprentice, mage, healer. I don't even think I said wizard, herbalist. I don't think I said mystic either. Magician, warlock, spellbinder, sage, elder, archmage. Okay. Start here. Uh, boxes, right. What do I want to do with all these boxes? Hmm, that's a good question. You know what? For right now, they can go in so that I have them close at hand. I could put a lot of them in here. So we're not going to have any additional cosmetics for a little bit that I'm aware of. Unless we get more cosmetics with this, with update uh, 4. And then for that matter, this can have the rest. For the exact same reason. Let's get rid of that one. Okay, there we go. So now, I don't think I need that. Now we start our migration. Welcome in. All right, so low and slow, small jobby goes all the way to the end. Man, that's some serious, like, <laughs> I don't even know if you want to call that rags to riches. That's just like, just, yeah. We were all scrubs at one point in our lives, <laughs> in our gaming lives. It's like almost straight up Robin Hood dude over here. Not that. This. Damn it. Yeah, it's a little twitchy. I don't know how much I love that, but we'll deal with it. I can't wait till we get some way to uh, label these things. Uh, some kind of a. Uh, what do we call it? Like a like a banner that we stick on the box and we just lay or or just give us an option and we okay 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 so oh it's upstairs so the sh the uh, flame shrine flame altar now has a way to rename it if they also give us the same thing for containers that would work really well all right this is all healer.
Boy, the uh, the hood for healer set is ugly. Now we're level thirteen. Okay. Makes me wonder if I should leave any gaps here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna stay straight as it is right now. I can always spread it out as needed. That's straight up, uh, like almost like Inquisitor type wear. Alright, a lot of herbalist stuff. If I remember right, I wore that for a long time. I wore that all the way till I was level, uh, max gear, or at least a lot of it. I still remember when, uh, <laughs> uh, where is it? And I still remember when this thing was so ridiculous. I, the highest I got it was 103 per second. It, it was way, way, way overboard. However, they, they nerfed it so bad it's now stupid. And I'm a little salty about how much they nerfed it, but it is what it is. No. Wow, really? This is some spiky finger gauntlets, whatever you call them. Really? You had to... Oh. <laughs> That's one thing that I dislike about the mannequins. You can put the cosmetic stuff on it without having to have it in your bag, but if you take it off of it, it puts it back into your bag. Or it puts it into your bag, even though it wasn't in there to begin with. Which is annoying. Then you gotta figure out where it took it from. And it would be right there. Okay. So this is all Warlock, okay. I just thought about something. I could classify these a little more by doing some doing the blue block over here somewhere. I, I'm not sure exactly what I would do. The blue block over here. 
the red block over here, because this is going to be the warrior stuff, and in the center, something to do with the green block, because this is the ranger. Just to give you a visual cue as to where you're going for what gear. I think that could work out pretty well. Have I put anything in here yet? <laughs> I could do <laughs> I it probably looks stupid. Do the, using the blue blocks do an M a W, but I don't know how the hell I would do the R. <clears throat> Excuse me. There's just really not enough space here to do an R down here. Doing it over top looks like it would be a little stupid, I think. One thing I would like to see come to now, whether this is a uh, creative mode or otherwise mods, for example, there is a mod, and unfortunately I don't know the name of it, there is a mod for Minecraft that allows you to do very tiny block size. Unfortunately, it just absolutely destroys your FPS. But it allows you to do such small block size that you can make a Minecraft building look... Real life is not a correct answer, but very, very detailed. Whereas our blocks here, obviously, this is... You know, granted, Minecraft is like that, whereas ours is like that. So we're already an eighth of the size-ish of Minecraft. But the blocks they have in it would break this thing up into like 50 different smaller blocks. And man, that'd be so cool if we could do that in Enshrouded. That'd be amazing. Yeah, I'm kind of glad I didn't put any spaces between them. Well, that's why there's only three. Because I took one. I thought it was weird. I was like, why is there only three? Duh.
the irony of this whole thing, of all this that I thought, man, that's that's a that's a lot of good space. We're gonna have enough room for a lot of stuff. I only got four extra. Holy crap! I mean, I don't think we're getting four uh, new mage, four new warrior, and then four new. You know, I, I think we're only getting probably, if I had to guess, well, I don't know. Maybe we will get four because we—it's a whole new level cap. Unless they're going to allow us to upgrade our older gear, like we do with weapons. I don't know. Four may not be enough. I may have underestimated what I'm going to need for this. Now, uh, an easy remedy is I can bump this end out to put one more there. I could squeeze this over by one and put another one there. That gives me two more. It gives me six extra. It's a fair bit. Let's go check all this real quick. Make sure we're all empty. Alright, that is all the armor for Mage. Oh, that's a problem. Shit. I hope they're in order. That one definitely was. I suppose I can just look at them in here, so... Okay, all right, so that's that. Then slit in the helm and bug eyes. Copper, and then copper for the last one. It's weird, I couldn't get to it. Slit the copper, okay, all right, we're all right. I was always pretty partial to this chess piece. I just, I don't know. I think it has a nice look to it. Like a cavalier type of uh, character. Not quite swashbuckler, but but definitely not full knight. Kind of, kind of that middling. Walks a walks a, a fine line. No. Really? I wonder if that's going to become a problem. The way the hitbox works, actually being able to get to those. And these things, feet are sticking out all over the place. Oh, with boots on, yeah. Okay, so they... Never mind. They're all doing it. Oh, this way. I don't know why I keep going that way. I have two damn stairs. Oh, so close. Uh, 
And then probably everybody's favorite helm, at least. I wonder why Keen gave the uh, the North stuff the negative shroud, uh, negative shroud time. They f they figure the gear was too overpowered and they didn't want people just using it all the time. Maybe. Very shiny. Your enemies will see you coming from a mile away. Maybe that's the point. Probably ceremonial gear anyway. Even fancier. Welcome in. Welcome another person. I so badly want to try to lure some of the rams and all that into the base somewhere and then quickly pen them up and you have like an indoor pen but I swear I saw someone try that and they just like eventually just teleport out like when you log off and log back in they teleport back to their original spawn location or something it'd be fun though if you get it to work. But we're, we're going to have animal husbandry soon anyway, so that's all right. Some kind of, like, mountain goat and who knows whatever else. Someone said something about some kind of, like, a chicken, maybe? Probably a, a shroud version of a chicken. Oh, boy. Am I going to have enough space for all these?
crap. <laughs> I thought 66 mannequins would be plenty. I don't know that 66 mannequins is going to be plenty at all. I guess it just goes to show the sheer level of gorgeous set. Uh, the sheer level of volume of gear that we already have in the game. Which is only maybe 60... 65% finished, maybe. I'm curious to see if they take the mountain biome all the way to the top of the map. Uh, my... Excuse me. <coughs> I am surmising that it is going to be on the far east. So... My best guess on this is that it's this chunk here, possibly clear over to this way, and I have a feeling that we're gonna that there's gonna be a quest line coming up through this dam that's also like a a POI, and because it is red shroud, I wonder if we have we'll have to upgrade our. Uh, Flame Shrine to level 7, then. That'd be cool. So I'm curious to see how far this way goes, if it is over here, and if it goes all the way to the end of the map, which is like this or something. It'll be interesting to see. I do have another option. I could take this room further that way and make the room bigger, longer. Because I've got tons, I got all this space here. As long as I'm not too, I might have to bring the height down. Maybe. I'll have to see. Uh, but I can bring it, I mean, hell, I could come all the way and not really have a hallway at all if I needed to. So we'll see how, how tight this gets, because I'm already down to three mannequins over there. I got a whole other box left. And that's two of them, so I only have one mannequin left. I don't think that's going to work, Jack. Empty, 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 empty. Okay, we got all that. Okay, that's a, that's a little twitchy might have to change how we're doing this mannequin thing. How did that happen? That's weird. Alright. One free is definitely not going to be okay. I think four free is perfectly fine, but one is not... It's not going to be enough. The good thing is, there aren't that many ranger pieces. So, we should be okay on Ranger. <laughs> I 
Now for the hard part. They're both. They're, it's in a straight line. What do I? Do I? Do I go alternate? Man, I don't know how I want to do this. Start with high level and go down to low level, but then do I swing around and it's and low level is actually here? Yeah. I'm not really sure how I want to do that. Let's do high here, low right here. I mean, I think people will be able to tell just from a glance, so it should be fine. I just had it. There we go. Yeah, it's gonna be too. Well, I can take part part of it though. Yeah, I can't fit ten more. Okay. Why is there a weird... Hmm, I don't know what's going on with that. Is this lower than that, really? Apparently so. Level 18, level 23. Way detailed level 18, not barely any detail in the 23. That's weird. We will come back for the last one. I don't know where I'm going, apparently.
So it looks like it's going to give us four of the ranger spaces left. We're just kind of screwed on melee with only one available. I'm probably going to end up having to extend the hall. Because right now this is literally directly underneath the the original space. Like this doorway is the doorway entrance. It's in the same spot. It's I went up. You can see where the the two people are. What I did is up there on the step I bored a hole straight down and used that as my reference. I wanted to make sure I was getting the the footprint the same. I don't know that it matters why I got it the same, but what I did at the time. All right, so we have four left for Ranger. We have four left for Mage, and we have one left for Melee. And I have both sides for all the, like, this kind of crap. Speaking of... Uh, yeah, that didn't have that. It's this. Might as well craft one more set. Put it in the box. So that's what all this will be. It's all the kind of weird shitometer stuff that nobody. Uh, I don't remember. Does she make. It? She only makes the cosmetic. Okay. We have the first set down there, okay. Let's just check some of these just to make sure. We definitely have that goofy set there. All right, milady. Do you have any armor for us that I don't already have? I sure hope I have deer stalker. This scout set level eight. Let's look for that marksman and the deer stalker. Let's check it to make sure. I believe that's scout set. That is. There's the other one. Why do these look exactly the same? Did I mess something up? Assassin. Damn it, what, how did I mess that up? What's in the boxes? Assassin. Oh shit. Assassin must have been a four and I, I'm stupid. I gotta redo the whole th Oh, kill me. Uh, yeah, there's Deerstalker. Ah, oh, kill me. For some reason, assass I thought Assassin was a 2, but it was a 4. Well, now we have 5 open for... Ranger. Took me a minute.
If only we could pick up the box with the uh, mannequin on top of it and just move it. That'd be sweet. Only have to move four, so it's not that bad. I feel dumb that I didn't notice, though. Done there. Not that. Uh, da -da -da. Let's go ahead and just replicate what it is up there. Each get two spaces. With one Actually, let's just give the Twitch one one, and then we'll leave two spaces for whatever maybe is coming in this update, maybe? Mm, but I have two sets. Fine, fine. A lot of sets, actually. You know what? Let's just leave it for that reason. We'll leave some up here, leave, and then have that down there for now until we decide otherwise. I messed that up. That's better. Okay, so we got a little spot there. Could definitely use more light in here. I'll have to figure something out that looks appropriate for the space. All right, it's time to get back to doing the, uh... no, we're going to have to reset the day. It is entirely too dark to be messing with this crap back here. Alright, 
Let's get back to work. And I am not looking forward to moving all those dishes that are all so lovingly stacked. Oh, I'm not looking forward to that. Okay, so we've got plenty of space there. I don't know if I'll need to do a corner since we're going to do double tall. All right, let's start with, what do we got in this box here? Okay, it's all empty. All right, good. So, wonk. Nice. Much easier than how we did it last night. <laughs> I took heed of my own comment and emptied my bags except for the thing we're working with. Hopefully we will get the ability eventually once if we're in our flame shrine we should be able to craft like maybe make it so it has to be in the magic containers. I'd be fine with that. Has to be in one of these jobbies in order to be able to craft as long as you're within the flame shrine and the crate, the magic chest is within the flame shrine. I think that would work just fine. Uh, let's put these way down here. Actually, let's display them because we're going to be using them anyway. And that way I don't have to dig them out of a box to grab them and use them as a box. Noise. All right. Hmm. Corner makes more sense, except that I'd be this weird divot in the ground that I don't like. But if I go all the way there, then I have to come out here. This is going to be weird. Three. I don't know. Maybe I can display something right there or something just to get it to look better. I don't know. Figure it out. Still, in the same space that I had three, I'll now have six in the same uh, volume of space, this little corner. So it'll still work out either way. Now, we need the little block, yes, and... I do two of these lights. Oh, wait, 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 wait. we gotta do... 
the block in there first, the, the uh, chest in there first. Holy crap. Okay, it's off it's off a little bit left and right, but man, I got that one close. That was a good guess. Noise. No no no. Grab the whole thing, dummy. more. No way I got it dead on. Holy shit, I got it dead on. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Um, yeah, that happened. I need another one of those. And there we go. Decent way to end it. I really wish I had left a column there and there's no way in hell I'm moving this whole stack over just to make it look nicer. Yeah. I'm I'm not that high speed. I, I got a lot of energy in me, but I, yeah, it's not that much. Alright. I got all this stuff to deal with now. Alright, so what do we got? We got heads in that one. We have six boxes for what was three. Man, it's so hard to get them perfectly vertical. Wait, did they have a bowl in it? How? What did they have in there? I think they had this in it. And let's put these next to it. Let's see. Which one is it? Let's see. Yeah. I can't see... Uh, we'll put dang it, I hate the lean. I want to put the cups up front so that they can be seen easier.
Of course they're going to sink down into it. Perfect. That's fun. Seems like this one should be a part of whatever's this direction and just leave these two as dishes. Otherwise it seems like a bit of a it's a bit much. Let's do also actually can I just craft some? Uh is it survival? Where's it at? There's dishes. There we go. It'll give us a little bit more variety. Put these plates up here. Yeah. And then, because we have these bowls, Damn it, that looks so bad. That's better. I think that's good enough. That gives a pretty good idea of what it is you're doing in that space. weird how it transfers items sometimes, but it doesn't transfer items always. Oops, wrong box. You know, like, it'll shoot that over there occasionally, but it doesn't always shoot it over there, and then sometimes it doesn't shoot anything over there. Always found that a little weird. And a little random as to what it picks to fly over the rainbow into the other box. Alright, so we got all that and we got still got a box open. That's I think that's good. That way we got dishes with a box open. We got heads under the heads. Yeah. Oh, and I, I do have... Where's it at? There's one item we need, this guy. And that's a good idea. We will place one the back here. And then we'll put this one in the bottom. So we'll have a start of something for another box of dishes. I may leave this empty just in case and still start here going that way. Just just a little, you know, thought bubble in my head that I, I need some extra space. Of course I messed it all up. Screw you. Damn it. I hate when it does that. It drives me crazy. So that's something we just don't need at all. We're not going to use. Just get it out of my box. Okay. It's going to mess this whole thing up too. You know what? Everything, yeah. Nothing's going to be... 
going to match. Well, fun times. There we go. Very good. Alright, moving all this back. I just need to build that thing over again. That's just one block, it is just one block. Okay. No problems. That is not the same height. I don't think it really matters. Oh, I can't even get up that high, okay. Let's do it the same so that we're... I even put it in the wrong damn spot. Oh, dummy. It's probably because it snapped in the wrong spot. I think that's that is the answer it looks like that is correct it is snapping to the wrong spot okay now to this easiest way to do this would be this way Yeah, it didn't do it that way. Okay, so they did do it by hand. Or, I'm on the wrong one. Wow. I'm trying to demo my own work all of a sudden.
Yeah, it's pretty good. Something like that. Alright, reset the day. That's a, that's something I really want with a creative mode, is the ability to set my time of day and lock it there, so I can just build without having to deal with the day-night cycle. And the incoming weather cycle. So that all looks good and the same. All right, you, sir, are in the wrong spot since I moved you. Thank you very much. All right, big boy, you're first. Hey, that works for me. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, man. One of these days, my brain will work. It's like you get, you know, you get going and you just kind of space out and forget what you're doing, kind of, and shit like that happens. <laughs> you forget to build the rest of the platform. Whoops. That's all right. <laughs> it's kind of funny, though. Can't lie about that. All right, so we got that back now. Let's put these guys back up. Welcome in. Whoever just showed up, appreciate you. Get the old hammer out and start whacking. So, we're going to go right here. It's not the right button. Uh 
Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Is that the hollow hall? Well, one thing it is is dirt, and those won't sit very well on dirt. So I need to test out to see if I messed up, or if I have to put a new uh, a new floor in down there. I think it'll be okay. I think that'll be just fine. It's a little little wonky in spots, but I think I can get enough flat that it'd be it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Oh, but that is a problem. Okay, I think I just breached the ceiling. It's okay. We can fix it. I think we can fix it. But a chasm to nowhere or something? What the hell's that about? That was weird. Yeah, well, it's fixed now, so whatever. Well, what the hell it did, but it fixed. This change will give us, uh... Why is the camera moving in so much there and it doesn't it didn't in on other ones? That's so weird. This will give us space for, uh, well beyond... Update 4. Lay the groundwork now. So that we don't have to do this again every single update. <laughs> I've already done it. Uh, let's see, we did it for Shra Shroud and Mire. I've done it for uh, Millie's the Mire and uh, Back to the Shroud. And now I'm doing it for Update 4, so this is the third time. Hopefully, this will prevent me from having to do it on the next whatever Update 5 is going to be. I don't like that there's grass showing through. How do you fix that? Okay. I'll probably still have to do a little bit more. But for now, that is okay. Ooh, maybe it's okay. It's off by a hair, but I think it's all right. I think we'll be all right. Yep, there's grass. Okay. Sorry, that's weird. My mouse started being stupid. <laughs> I just put it like that to be funny. No, it's not that's not very nice. 
It's off by a hair, but if I move it over anymore, it, it goes all wonky. I'm going to have to leave it there. That's all right. Not terribly upset by it. Nice. Hey, we missed one. Doing it every other. I missed one right there. Alright, just gotta be like that. <laughs> Even this looks a little weird. It's just whatever. Uh. Okay, because I'm going to leave this one blank, so we're going to start here. Okay. Yay, it's all messed up. Kill me. Okay. Back to Dragon. You know what I should do? I should put a uh, trampoline up there too. If it fits. Nothing really else needed in that corner anyway. Might be able to fit it. I'm a liar. Holy crap. Okay, that's not going to work. <laughs> it's a little big. Oh. Damn it. I missed a whole entire... Uh, let's do it all over again. <laughs> I want to cry. I don't know how I missed a whole stack. It's like the, uh, <laughs> the ranger stuff that I messed up by putting two of this assassins simultaneously next to each other and just, you know, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to notice that till later. I think it's what you do so much, you know, you're just looking at this over and over again. It's kind of that just muscle memory, and you're just grabbing the first box that shows up in your brain and just happened to be the wrong box. Okay. <laughs> so now that's an empty. So that's another one that's going to be weird. Uh, let's see. Let's leave an empty below. So this had five. So I need to make sure I fit five of the roughly six underneath this section. So I have one extra box here, and like this extra row, and the two rows in the other one. And then we have that whole corner if we need to use that too. Depends on what all they give us. And think about it for a minute. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, 
So that one, that one, and that one. Okay. So we're doing that one, that one, that one. We'll start books there because I'm going to get into some serious crunch here over here. So it'll leave us a whole stack and then one row. Yeah, we'll do it that way. So this one needs to be down there. Yep, because this is just, yep, 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 that's what I want. This one's going to be below. See, now I took that room. Yep, because, you know, reasons. Stakes with prison stuff. Out. Yes, stakes with prison underneath it. Yep, I like that. So this one will be stakes. I mean, we do have a fence, but I could always put another extra little fence or stake up there. Let's do like, these are huge. Um, let's just go ahead and do it anyway. I know they're huge, but. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Are we at this one? Yes. And you're this one? Nope. You're the top one. Okay. Last one is this one. All of your graveyard stuff. prison stuff. Boy, I hope we get a prison door soon. My my little solution is, is decent. It, perfectly perfectly reasonable solution for it, but it's it's not as good as actually getting what we need for it. Okay, so this is going to be books, books, and rugs. And it's completely full. So I think I'll use the two Maybe put these underneath it and just put those. Let's do this. I want to put these on top next to it and leave both of them below empty. Except I want to put those below the other books so I have an extra spot there. That'll give us more space if they give us more rugs. That's what I was going to do. I was, yep. It's just early.
Still unsure how I want to do this. Do I want to keep the little uh, jet out that I did there, jut out, whatever you call it, or do I want to repair this back, restore it back to what it was? Of course, now with all this stuff out here, I'll have to redo all the ground and everything, so I don't know if I love that idea. Okay, so we're grass. There we go. Nice. Same sight line, okay. Oh, oh. So it's these two. I like it. Now, take all these, put them right below the books exactly where it makes sense for them to be. Perfect. So we got all that available for the books if if they give it, I, I hope they give us more books eventually because we could use more variety. I'd like to have single books that lie down flat. These guys that lie down flat. Um, be nice to have larger chunks of these that takes up most of a predetermined section of a shelf but varied so like some standing up maybe a couple laying down or a prop or I don't know something just more variety because man placing a lot of books by hand is for the birds it's uh, and it's not fun all right so it's got that then that then that and that okay I can figure that out. Oops, stuck. Never stop there. I might not be able to get some of those lights out. Okay, so it's gonna be right here. This 
split the difference between these guys. Might want to really make sure I get that all the way back. Didn't mean to shoot it over the edge. Yep. Damn it. Hey, that works. Nice. Oh, it's us. Actually, it is. It's this one that's out really far. There we go. Okay. Let's reset the day. Like an idea. I'm gonna take a picture of this side, which is, you know, what what it is now. Hide HUD. So take a picture. And then we'll go take a picture of a completed side. Well, there's boxes and shit in the way, but come on. Hide the camera, damn it. There we go. Half tempted to put some of the stone back because it looks a little weird, but we'll let it be. Alright. Uh, next box. At this point, pretty much everything should just be full. Because I had had a hard enough time getting everything to fit anyway. missing. Are we missing something or did I leave a space because we got something new? I think that's how it ended up being, which means this is going to be a pain in the butt. It's going to mess the whole entire thing up as I move it. That sucks so bad. Next, I'm gonna mess that whole thing up too. Yay! All right. So that's these guys. Do a little demo. Okay, so that might actually need the extra space, so I'll put these under these two and maybe 
either leave that blank or I'll use it for those, because I need five for that one. Stone, so it should be okay. It's kind of hard to tell if I'm seeing down into the hollow hall or not. Okay. Dang it, because I actually want these over here. So I need three, so we'll do one, two, three, we'll do... I'll have to figure that out. Figure out how I want that. I think these should be at the bottom of this side. So, above that... This one... I'm gonna do this one above it. And then, this goes in the top left, and we'll have the bottom left available that I can put more in. And maybe a stack to our left available also. I'll have to figure out if I want to do that or not. Sure seems like there is supposed to be something in between these, but we're going to do it like this. Leave the end open instead of the second row. Which, to be honest, I don't know why I left the second row open, but this, I'm sure there was some reason.
Oops. <laughs> I was seriously going to drag that over there. Oh my god. <laughs> ah, it's too funny. Okay. That is not going to work. Stone must be gone. And yes, if the blinking's driving you crazy, it's driving me crazy too. I wish Keen could fix that. It's any time you uh, are near a fire but you're not sheltered. Or you're kind of like on that borderline of being near a fire but unsheltered. And it just sits there and blinks at you over and over and over again. It just makes me want to... Oh my god, it drives me crazy. Okay, so we got... I'll try to leave that tower open, but this needs five, so I'll probably have to use one of them. First things first, I need to move this whole door. Yeah, that's what I thought. Really? Right at the last second you had to move a little, just a little far? Jerk. Alright, let's not move a little further this time. No. Alright, okay, you know what? Let's put some windows on it too. Let's put a big old window. Oh, I forgot about that. The windows can't turn. We'll do that. What's this? Hobbit door. Right. And the giganto doors. And then we'll just put a regular window. Let's do a VUCA window. Like that. Oh, right. We have windows up there. I don't really need this here. And in actuality, I don't need that door to be back that far. Yeah, I got it. Alright. These are all full? Yeah. Okay. I don't even know how I'm going to do all these. So that's full. You're one slot less, and you're full. So everybody but this guy is full. So... Uh, do you first, and do you into that slot, and then... I think that'll work. And then I'll have the slot below it empty as well. Yep. 
Yep, I figured as much. I did see a new window in um, one of the videos. Now, will we be able to craft it? It's hard to say because there's windows in the base game that have been in the base game since the beginning that we still can't craft and everybody's all pining over it. It's the one that uh, it looks like this at the base and then has a circle at the top of it that's like a half window. And we want it really bad and they, I don't know, I still haven't decided they wanted to give it to us? I don't know. Really? Alright. Now... The rest of these need to go into boxes. So that was Windows. This is Windows. So that's going to be next to it. Doors with Windows. Alright, so this is going to be bottom directly in front of me. Bottom in front of me. I don't know why I'm even doing that. Do that. Then this is going to be top in front of me. Let's do some chopping. Hey, I got another one right on. It's off by like a millimeter. I'm not even going to worry about a millimeter. I'm good. Alright. Top in front of me. Alright. 
So then these guys, it's going to be, that's straight doors. That's the beginning of the doors. So that's going to be top, that's going to be bottom. Bottom. About to be El Dark again. Just like death and taxes, the sun always goes down. There's that. Drop another one of these. Get out the old trust of hammer and whack it up again. Go away, stinky block. Okay, that one's off a little more than I like. It was good uh, front to back. There we go. Alright, crap doors. Top. Well, starting with crap doors. They're not all crap doors. I kind of like the uh, polished wooden. Pretty nice looking. Boy, we're getting there. I, I like the look of it better than just jamming them all in like this. I did my best not to lose too many of the blue, but God, you can see I had to, I had to really slam them in there in order to get everything to fit. Oh, yeah, I'm not looking forward to moving all that. Not at all. Ugh. Not at all. Get a drink. All right, let's reset the day so I can see better. Looking good, looking good. I'd love to put some of the other banners out there. The only problem is they are absolutely massive and they're not going to fit. 
Okay, so that was just two blocks back. Two blocks back. Right. How am I going to get that thing? Jerk. Right, that's, yep, that's, that's definitely what I wanted to do. Okay. Everything's out of the way now. This is why there's one stuck inside my wall and not in my, uh, Halloween build. I can't get these things. The um, pickup detection or collision or whatever it's called on these is absolutely terrible, and it's and it's specifically these flags on a pole. It's <laughs> completely absurd. Uh, let's try this. And I'm not even close enough. Damn it. Alright, let's get right up in its nuts. Stupid jerk. Really? Screw it, I'm not moving it. I'm too late. That's where you live now, buddy. It's your own fault. Next time, don't be such a jerk face. Takes care of all that. So what do we got? We have three of them. We got the hollow halls and those. Okay, so that's maxed. Maxed. Alright, so we're all maxed and I have... <coughs> I'll have four spaces which will give me one extra. Cool. Banners and banners and then artwork and nothing. So artwork top right with nothing underneath it.
what happened with that. Yeah, that is definitely the hollow hall right there. That that's a chunk of the ceiling of the hollow hall. Baba sheep over there. So then these bad boys. Go right here. Very nice. with an empty below it. And then... Uh, since those are the originals, I think I'll put them up top with this at the bottom. Which means I need to do these first. Get in there. That will be an, uh, a nice quality of life if Keen will give it to us. The ability to snap containers so they fit literally pixel perfect either on top of, beside of, in front or behind of. We're just snapping one directly to another. I would be very happy if they did that at some point down the road would make my day I need more boxes probably quite a few too All right, let's start with this one, and then I'll drop the rest on the ground. Okay. Yeah, so this is the top. Since it's the OG fla uh, banners and flags. This will be the bottom. since it's the new. That weirdly enough we did not get with hollow halls, we got with a different update. <laughs> I, I found that uh, amusing to say the least. Because as soon as we win the hollow halls, we're like, oh, we want those things. We didn't know about these, of course. We're like, we want those so bad. And then we finally got them. We're like, oh my god, they're amazing. And they really are. They're so cool, but they're so so big 
And I, I mean, I, I can't complain because I love them. All right, so we got all of those. We've got, sorry, wrong box. We got one space open, one box open, excuse me. Now for this stuff, I feel like we have too many fires out here. It's just like, it's just like too much. And I need to move five boxes worth. So, not entirely, that one's not full. I think all the rest are. Well, that would be if I hadn't been using them. Okay, so I only have one box that's not full, so I can do a two, four, fifth one's not full, and I have a sixth one available for the anything additionally. We'll have 11 spaces open for up to 11 new lights. Nice. All right. Oh, man, I'm not looking forward to moving all these. It's a lot. Someone was a uh, uh, pretty high speed when they uh, put all these things out here. I think I added some of these. Okay. Since we already have that big boy, let's get rid of this one. Keep his little brother. Kind of do that jobby with it. We'll move this up in front. Like that. I still feel like it's just it's just way too much. It also washes out all the light too. The, the the way that the light is, it gets all washed out right here, just because of how much lighting is happening in one space. I didn't need to condense it that much, but. I can tweak it. Yeah, I like the idea. Let's, uh, let's turn it a little bit. Wow, really? You jerk face. Standing right in front of it. Pick up the stupid light. There we go. That's a little bit better.
That goat over there is having himself a good old little little uh, grass party. Man, the light right here is really bugging me. I'm gonna reset the day because that's really driving me nuts. It's hard to see with the uh, I don't know what that's called volumetric lighting or something. The the god rays from the sun. So we got that space, and I need a box. Must has box. Welcome in. You're looking at it, wondering what the heck I'm doing. I'm renovating the public res the, the original public resource world in prep for update four, which is going to kick our butts because it's going to be a lot of stuff. So I got to make this thing ready to handle all the stuff that we're getting. We don't know all exactly what it is yet, but we know it's a lot. So taking it from what you see over there which was already the second renovation I did to this place for uh, Back to the Shroud and doing all this which is I would say adding about 40% more space maybe 50% more space so it's it's going to help a lot yeah it's going to make a big big difference All right, so the bottom one there is going to be empty and this is going to be over it yep Hang on a second. I gotta see. There. Oh nope. I'm going to. I'm going more over. So I'm going there, and I'm going there because that's actually gonna get pushed back. So I could leave a whole blank there in case we get a lot more of this stuff and start this here instead that I can't see because of the freaking god rays okay alright well I need to uh, chunk out the I can't see what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, I can't see anything of what I'm doing. Alright. We're going to have to offload this stuff for now. Because I need to move more. So... Alright, let's start with this one.
Oh, it's going to get messed up. Really? Click the button. Thank you. Alright, now for the one that's going to get all messed up as soon as I move it. It's going to change a lot too because these... Uh, they had stacked them in 100. The original creator of the public resource world, and while I do it's going to go to 5. Or some weird number. 700! Yep, that makes total sense. Keen's all like, Yeah, we have to we have to kind of change things because you guys have these things stacked really high and we gotta and then they have stuff that like stacks in really weird things. Five for that, but twenty for that. Seven hundred for that. There's a candle that stacks to five hundred, but the other stacked to five, because make it make sense. Alright, that's empty. No, oh, actually, I'll just go ahead and use it. I still can't see a damn thing because of all the smoke from that right there. Alright, do I have a flat surface now? I can't even tell. Nope. Now I do. Is that rock? It is rock. Okay. If I don't do that step, the, uh, nope, what did I miss? How did I miss all that? The, uh, chests won't stack properly. They'll just go all cattywampus. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm missing a chunk of the hollow hall ceiling. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to fix that later. <laughs> Whoops. Nice and slick. That's cool. I can see. I thought it was bugs crawling across the floor. I'm like, wow, when they add that? It's the fireflies <laughs> being shadowed through the smoke. That's pretty cool. Tripped me out, though, but it's pretty cool. Alright, so now we got our space, so we're going to leave a column there. We're going to do, which means I, I kind of want to move this, the fire over some. Give that more room, maybe I'll put a different banner out on that. 
Okay, let's let's move the fire. If I can move it. Cause the last one's gonna be right here. Stop doing that. Jerk face. Yeah, that's a little more representative of these three space these three right there. That'll work. Alright. So, blank, and then these three, which I'm missing. Do I need to do this too? Probably. How much did I just chuck chunk out of there? What the hell? Uh, that I think I'm seeing right into the hollow hall right there. <laughs> yeah, be a little more careful. There we go. Very nice. Nice and uniform. Me likes. Alright, so we got our six. Now I just gotta figure out how I wanna do five into six. We can start with this up top and it's gonna be a muddled mess. Sweet. Now, same thing again. <laughs> yeah. There we go. You, 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 and you. And that's where I run out of the hanging. Because I've been using them. It's alright. We'll get her all fixed before I release out the these new this new save file though. Alright, so that's gonna be the top. That's gonna be That is gonna be this piece here, which we're gonna leave open below it.
Okay, since that's crypt bleeding over, crypt needs to be the bottom right there. Why am I, why, why did it move me up? So this needs to be the bottom right next to it. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. Technically a continuation of the first set. Same again. Which one is more? I mean, that really is. And that and that. Okay, so we're going to do this one below it. Below the base level ones. And this right above the uh, the hollow halls lights. Very good. Yeah, because you got this progression going from the crappiest lights up to the better quality lights, and then the bigger lights, and etc. So that makes sense. Then there, then there, and then empty. So now we got extra space. We've got blanks here in the middle just in case. And this needs to be pushed back two blocks. And then we'll have a, yeah, it's coming together. It is coming together. We are just almost at three hours. I think I'm going to have to cut it now. And uh, we'll be back tomorrow. I'm going to stream about the same time. I will finish this out. And then we'll go into any final details trying to really flesh this thing out as well as we can. So it's prepared for update four, which we hope is this month. I appreciate everybody watching. Thanks for coming. Have a good one.